A friend of mine, he had a great analogy. He said, uh, he said, you know, imagine you're the caveman and you went back to the cave and you, you got a stick and it's burning. And the one guy goes, well, what is this? Uh, I call it fire. <laughs> what does it do? Well, it can do a lot of things. It can keep us warm. It can cook our food. It can scare the scary animals away. And, and he goes, well, what about the waste? And the fire guy goes, well, you know, as long as we keep the cave well vented and so forth, it should be all right, you know, and, and don't put your finger in it. And, you know, keep a safe distance from it. And, and fire should work out really good for us. The guy says, ah, I don't, I don't like this fire thing. I'm going to go sleep out in the savannah tonight. You know, I'm not going to be in the cave with a scary fire. And that night the saber-toothed tiger eats the other guy, you know. And the fire guy mates and has children. And his progeny use fire and so on. <laughs> so it wasn't long before the human race was really into fire. Because everybody who wasn't was dead. <laughs> Societies that use energy effectively succeed. Societies that don't will diminish. Which one do we want to be?